Welcome to yet another funky daily devotional. Today's verse of the day is Proverbs 17, verse 9. Whoever would foster love covers over an offense, but whoever repeats the matter separates uh, close friends. And that's Proverbs 17, 9. You got to forgive and you got to forget some of that stuff. And yes, I'm wearing my sweater backwards. <laughs> uh, victory comes one day at a time. Amen to that. Joy, a very real verse. A really real force, sorry, is today's message. The joy of the Lord is your strength, Nehemiah 8.10. Actually, we're in Nehemiah right now with uh, Westside Church in, here in Vancouver. So that's pretty awesome. Joy, it's not a warm, happy feeling you're supposed to have now and then when things aren't are going well. It's much more than that. Joy is one of the most powerful spiritual forces in the world. Look again at Nehemiah 8.10 and I'll show you why. If you were to diagram that scripture, remove the phrase of the Lord, you would find that what it's truly saying is joy is strength. The two are interchangeable. That's what makes joy so crucial. You can't live a life of faith without being strong in the Lord. And when God wants to make you strong, joy is what he uses to do the job. Joy is not just a state of mind. It's not just a fleeting emotion. Joy is a very real force. And the devil doesn't have anything that can stand up against it. Just as the fear has to yield to faith, discouragement has to yield to joy. Since joy is one of the fruits of the Holy Spirit, you already have it residing in within you, but you must develop it, confess it, and live by it if you want to enjoy its power. Whatsoever circumstances you are facing today, you can be full of joy, you can be strong in the Lord, you can draw on the supply of the Holy Spirit within you and come out on top. Rejoice. Scripture reading is Psalm 18, 28 to 50. I'll read that in the NIV. Verse 28. You, Lord, keep my lamp burning. My God turns my darkness into light. Uh, with your help, I can advance against a troop. With my God, I can scale a wall. As for God, his way is perfect. Jinjin the cat's been scaling walls day and night. It's been so cute, so awesome. As for God, his way is perfect. The Lord's word is flawless. His shields all uh, who take refuge in him. For who is God besides the Lord and who is the rock except our God? It, it is God who alarms me with strength and keeps my way secure. He makes my feet like the feet of a deer. He causes me to stand on the heights. He trains my hands for battle. My arms can bend a bow of bronze. You can make, uh, you make your saving help my grace, and your right hand sustains me. Your help has caused me great, has made me break, great. You provide a broad path for my feet, so that my ankles do not give way. I pursued my enemies and overtook them. I did not turn back till they were destroyed. I crushed them so they could not rise. They fell beneath my feet. You armed me with strength for battle. You humbled my adversaries before me. You made my enemies turn their backs in flight, and I destroyed my foes. They cried for help, but there was no one to save them. To the Lord, um, but he did not answer. I beat them as fine as windblown dust. I trampled them like mud in the streets. You have delivered me from the attacks of the people. You have made me the head of nations. People I did not know now serve me. Foreigners cower before me. As soon as they hear of me, they obey me. They lose all hearts. They come trembling in their strongholds, um, from their strongholds. The Lord lives. Praise be to my rock. Exalted be God my Savior. He is the God who avenges me, who subdues nations under me, who saves me from my enemies. You exalted me above my foes. <coughs> bless me. <laughs> God bless me. You exalted me above my foes. From a violent man you rescued me. Therefore I will praise you, Lord, among the nations. I will sing the praises of your name. He gives his king great victories. He shows unfailing love to his anointed, to David and his descendants forever. Thank you, Heavenly Father, for your great love and kindness to all of us. God, my goodness, you are the strength. You are the joy to be held. You are the, the beauty in the, in the times of difficulty, God. You are what gets us over the hump. 
Thank you, Lord, for such a wonderful day yesterday. Thank you, Lord, for making and meeting lots of friends. Thank you, God, for getting me out of my shell and getting me social again. Thank you, God, for healing my nose and, and um, keeping me well. God, you are such a good and faithful and wonderful Father. And uh, you teach us how to be good and faithful and wonderful because of the power, because of the strength, because of the might of Lord Almighty in us. So may God bless you and keep you this day. And thank you, Lord, for all that you do. And I pray this in the name of Yeshua HaMashiach. I pray, amen.